beautiful people welcome to our channel and uh, i beg if not the first time we see this channel and i beg i beg you my people i beg you to subscribe and hit the bell notification uh good morning good afternoon and good evening from wherever you're watching um so let's go straight to the news um at least 16 nigerians have been deported by the Ghanaian financial and intelligence agency over their alleged involvement in cyber crimes in the country the controller of the semi-command Nigeria Immigration Service, NIS Dr. Chuku Emeka, during a news conference on Friday, said it was discovered during investigation that most of them left Nigeria to other West African countries through illegal means. He also revealed that some of the deportees were into criminal activities due to get rich quick syndrome among the youths. Oh boy, hmm. Small as they shake, small as they shake, go fear Ghana now. We Ghana, the Ghana don't no use I say our, our Nigerians. Why you not just come and lock them for 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 for, for, for Ghana there? It will be the essence of deporting them. Eh? Nigeria, and the Nigerian government cause all these things really happen. So, so but some people do go say no living government fault. Me I tell you, no jobs. Government no provide jobs for people. How person, how Nigeria go day the price of food go day more than more than your salary. Only to eat price of feed in day more than seventy percent of your salary. So what do you they work for? Eh? Now the government no provide jobs. They they blame the youth. You understand? They go they blame the youth. Say the youth no do anything. Now for the farming where people they manage more, you carry your Boko Haram boys, Buhari and the people spread them everywhere. Yeah, people won't work. People just they frustrated. Eh? People they for if say government create jobs and people can't they do your own now. Then government feel blame people. Now no loans. As a young person, you must get collateral. Where you won't see collateral for? Where you won't see collateral for? So these are the things we will keep on saying. The government should create jobs before they start blaming the youth. And the leadership on top is stealing one way. So when the leadership on top is stealing one way, what do they expect the youth to do? If they give them confidence and morale to steal now. You understand? Create before you criticize. Create when you create and people know it, then you begin fight them. Or as you they create, you they fight them. Everything cause Boko Haram. No, with poverty and the uh, lack of education over the years. Now people create, begin carry uh, uh, gun, begin misbehave. So now the whole country don't work. So my advice is very well. We say create. You know, since Ghana, eh? Ghana know they use ICOs. I'm not saying they, they did anything uh, wrong here, but you know they should have locked them up in Ghana. Or they should. This is not a news. This is a news. You just lock the people quietly. No need to make noise about it. Eh? Anyway, guys, what do you make of this uh, story? Do you think they should have deported them or they should have locked them up in Ghana? And what do you? What are solutions you have so that this cybercrime could reduce? I beg, guys, let me know your thoughts in the comment section.